I had a Coke spoo down the stairs with just a few crunchies. Like, literally like five crunchies. Oh, still got mad at him. Stella, Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. It is 7 a.m. And it is 35 degrees out. But it is 56 degrees in Hydrox's shelter. That's like a 20 degree difference. I put the heated pet pad in it yesterday afternoon. Today we're breaking out the Halloween platters because we just ran out of the Happy Fall platters. So Halloween's on its way. It's maybe 10 days away. So uh, yeah, breaking out the Halloween platters. Jack-o'-lantern platters. And then this is Boo's Halloween plate. This is his jack-o'-lantern plate. The cats are having their primal raw chicken bites, which Boo does not like. And Boo is having the homemade raw cat food, which he ate a ton of yesterday. Now all of a sudden he doesn't want it. Eat your food, Boo, you like it. Maybe Simba wants it. Simba gonna eat it? Simba's eating it. Simba wanted it. So they're getting basically half of their breakfast right now. I sprinkled a little freeze-dried chicken on top of booze. So maybe he'll eat it. He should like it. He just ate it yesterday. Okay, it looks like he's eating it. It is 7.20 p.m. and I just got home and I looked outside and I saw a face near the heated water bowl and it took me a while to figure out what it was but it was a possum. The possum just walked away. Now when I was coming inside today I came in through the front door and I heard like what sounded like an animal in the bushes, like rustling around in the bushes. I thought maybe it was Hydrox and then he would walk around to the back, but I haven't seen him and I was going to step outside. Um, and that's what I'm gonna do now. So here's the automatic feeder, the heated water bowl. The heated water bowl is plugged in and right now it's on a timer. So it goes on um, like around 6 p.m. and it stays heated through the night and then it goes off in the morning because the days are still warm enough that nothing's gonna freeze. At night, it's gonna dip down. And the greenhouse is also on a timer. So at night, the, um, the Christmas lights inside the greenhouse come on and they keep it warmer in there. And then they go off in the morning. So right now, according to the thermometers outside, which are the top two, the top left is inside the greenhouse, it's 62 degrees, and the top right is hanging outside of the garage, which is 49 degrees. It actually feels like it's colder than 49 degrees. And if we look inside of Hydrox's shelter, it's about 63 degrees in there right now, and it's rising, which would make me think maybe there's a cat in there. You see how the temperature kept falling until 645, a little bit after 645, and then the temperature started going up. The cats are having their appetizers today, which is a little bit of chicken baby food with herbs in it. Right now, Boo's getting herbs maybe four or five days a week with a few days off. So he hasn't had his herbs in a few days. Stella's enjoying her baby food. She pretty much licked it all up already. She really loves it. And Simba has some too. He just came running in looking for whoever might have leftovers. He has them on the top of the stair landing. I don't know where Splash is. Look, he's trying to steal Stella's. Stella, don't let him steal your food. Is she gonna bonk him on the head? Stella gonna hit him? No, she's gonna be a lady and walk away. 
And Boo ate all of his appetizer. Good job, Boo. The cats are getting the Nature's Variety Instinct Raw Chicken Bites. They like those. And Boo's getting two things on his plate. He is getting half of a reconstituted primal raw rabbit nugget, freeze-dried raw. And that's what he's eating right now. And the other half of his plate is the homemade raw cat food, which is chicken. I was thinking of mixing them together, but I just wanted to see what would happen if I fed them to him side by side. Right now, every meal for Boo is like an experiment just to see what he will eat and what he won't eat. He's, he's definitely the fussiest eater out of all the cats. But at the same time, he's not because if I open a can, he'll pretty much just eat anything in a can. He's trying to get every last drop of that rabbit. He doesn't want to eat the chicken. I want to see what happens if I mix up the rest of the rabbit with that chicken. So I mixed up the other half of the rabbit nugget with the raw chicken. And it looks like he's eating it. We'll see what happens. Let's see if, how much of that he finishes. Then he's pretty much done with his dinner. Stella's done, Splash is done, and Simba is still eating. It looks like Simba's gonna finish every little chicken bite.
It is 9.20 p.m. right now. I just gave the cats crunchies. They're all having crunchies. They're getting about one tablespoon each. And we are just about to premiere our first Lucky Ferals video tonight. We finally got the YouTube feature on this channel. So that's pretty exciting. I have no idea what that's going to be like. But we'll see how it goes. Meanwhile, the cats just got their snacks. Right now it's about 10 p.m. and we had our first ever YouTube premiere on the Lucky Ferals channel tonight. I want to give a shout out to uh, everyone who gave super chat donations. I want to give a shout out to Tracy Yoshida for the $5 donation. She says, hi boo, it's my birthday. So happy birthday, Tracy. That was very, very nice of you to give that super chat. And I also want to give a shout out to Miss Vampire K for the $2 super chat donation. Uh, she says this is all I can give. Well, that is plenty. Um, thank you so much. That will definitely be put to good use on cat supplies. And I also want to give a shout out to Eva Lash for the $5 super chat donation. I don't know why that's not showing up right now. This is a live chat replay and a lot of the live chat is missing. So um, yeah, I don't know what's going on there. And for anyone else who gave a donation um, who I missed, um, I apologize. As you can see, this is not loading correctly. 6.30 a.m. Good morning, Simba. Good morning, Stella. Good morning, Boo. And Splashy was just here, which is why I got the camera out. But he let me pet him for a little bit. And then he ran into the kitchen. Um, so... Today and yesterday I've been on a new schedule where I'm getting up like much earlier and I'm trying to shift my day so I start earlier and I end earlier like I go to bed earlier and I just find that I'm able to manage my time much better when I get up earlier so I've been trying to do this except the cats are not used to it and they're like why are you getting up so early go back to bed because these cats uh, are not early risers. Like they normally like sleep until I get up in the morning. And now you can see they're still, they're still tired. <laughs> Stella's still tired. She wants to go back to bed. And Boo says he's just going to continue to rest in the cat tower. He's not getting up. Okay, this is what the cats are getting for breakfast. They're getting primal raw nuggets. They're getting half of a duck nugget and half of a turkey nugget. Uh, they're also getting the Nature's Variety Instant Grot Chicken Bites. I'm feeding them everything at once, but I'm keeping an eye on them to make sure no one's overeating. And on top of the primal nuggets, because they usually don't like eating these that much, I've put just a little bit of the chicken baby food because they really like the chicken baby food. So let's see if they'll eat. And I have two platters because I want all the cats to eat together on these platters, and they are Halloween platters. I had a Coke spoo down the stairs with just a few crunchies, like literally like five crunchies. Oh, Stella got mad at him because Stella was trying to eat off that platter. They could eat together, Stella. Stella, you and Boo can eat together, that's fine. Splash and Simba are digging into the other one. I need to watch Splash because he eats too fast. It looks like they're eating the Nature's Variety Chicken Bites and Boo's licking up the baby food, and Stella's just watching. I don't worry about Stella because she'll eat, like, what's left. Sometimes she waits till the other cats eat, and then she eats what's on the platters. And I know Boo's not going to like all those chicken bites on that platter, and Stella will eat them. My goal is just to get Boo to eat, like, that primal food that I put the baby food on. He's a smart boy, so he might just lick up the baby food. It's 7.30 a.m. right now. And I just looked outside and Hydrox is eating dry food out of the feeder. I don't know if he's been staying in the shelter or what. But right now it's 47 degrees out. But it does feel colder. There he is. See him? Hi. 
I went outside about 10 minutes ago and gave Hydrox half of a can of Trader Joe's chicken and rice dinner. I think it's chicken, turkey, and rice dinner. And he really likes it. He's been eating a lot of it. And then I gave Boo maybe one quarter of the can. Hydrox had about half of a can. And I gave Boo about a quarter of the can because Boo did not want to eat the raw food today. So Hydrox is happy and Boo's happy. And this is what is left of the breakfast right now. Pretty much all of the primal nuggets and like one quarter of the Nature's Variety Instinct Chicken Bites. I don't know why they're not eating these primal nuggets. 9.20 a.m. Splash is in Boo's room. He's looking out the window. He's watching the automatic feeder. Maybe there's birds out there. Hello, Stella. Stella was downstairs on top of the cat tower. She just came upstairs. How are you, Stella? You're a good girl? Stella just hissed at Boo. Here's Boo. Boo was sitting on the cat tower in the living room. But when he saw me with the camera, he got down from the cat tower because he wanted to say hello to me. So now Boo's laying on the play rug. And here's Stella. Hello, Stella. And here's Simba. Simba's on top of the cat tower. He's looking outside. Hello, Simba. Stella just got a paper towel bath. She's a very happy girl right now. Right, Stella? You happy? You got a paper towel bath? It's 10 a.m. Splash is laying by the window. I guess he could see out through the curtains. The curtains are sheer, but they're shut. Boo just jumped on the couch. He heard me turn the camera on. Hey, Boo. Simba's laying in the cat tower. Hey, Simba. How are you, fluffy boy? Boo's laying on the play rug. Hello, Boo. How are you? Hello, Boo. It is 6.15 p.m. I just got home. I opened the back door. And there's Idrox. I think he wants some food. And there's Stella. Hello, Stella. Did you have a nice day? So for dinner, Hydrox is getting the same thing he got for breakfast because he enjoyed it so much, which is half a can of the Trader Joe's chicken, turkey, and rice dinner. I think that's what the name of it is. So I'm going to give this to him. Here you go, Hydrox. Yeah. Want some food? There you go. You can eat it. Eat your food. Go ahead. I'm only a few feet away from him right now. I'm probably like three feet away from him. So that's really, really great that he would eat and not run. Good boy, Hydrox. Listen, Hydrox, you know the shelter's open right now. You got it? So the shelter's open. The heated pet pad is in there, so if you get cold at night, you could go in there. You don't have to stay in there all day, you know that, right? You could come and go. Uh, I moved my arm. He didn't like the fact that I moved my hand. Not the hand that's holding the camera. All right, Hydrox, let me, let me go. He came back to eat. I went in the garage to get something, and he walked right back to the food. watching this Lucky Feral's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.